Dave, I know it's not the outcome you wanted, but uh, a good night for yourself and the offense as a whole. Uh, you guys really did accomplish some things tonight. Yeah, I'd say in the first half, I think I think we looked really good. Um, you know, we were able to move the ball, score, score touchdowns, which was important. But uh, you know, in the second half, you know, we just didn't do a good enough job of executing. You know, we still moved the ball. There were still plays where. Uh, where we did a good job, but uh, we just didn't do a good enough job in the second half. The offensive line did an exceptional job against the, one of the top teams in the country in giving you a lot of time tonight and giving the, uh, the rest of the team uh, the ability to run these plays. They did. I think their confidence is, is continuing to grow from week to week. Is um, you know now we're into week six and continue to progress and grow together. So um, as long as they can play consistent, you know we'll, we'll be in good hands. How banged up are you guys? Uh, not too bad. Just a little, just an ankle. I uh, rolled my ankle, and you know, not obvious. I was a, I was able to play with it, so I'm good. Peyton, was there something on the tape that you guys saw in the secondary that you could exploit throwing the ball deep today? Um, I don't know that it was their second secondary more than our guys, just one on ones out there, and uh, we have confidence in them. We have we have faith in them that uh, you know, big six three, big six four body guys. If, if we put it up there, they're they're, they're going to have a good chance to go get one. Going after those one on one plays, how much of a step forward was it for that off this offense to really you know consistently do that and attack those kind of plays? Yeah, I mean they just continue to give them to us, and that's something that we haven't seen this year. They, there's there hasn't been defenses that, that have just consistently. Uh, dared us to throw one-on-one -on -one balls and 50-50 and balls, and, and you know we were able to come up with some big ones. Can you run us through that two-point conversion? What you were trying to get done? Today? Yeah, I, I mean it was no harm if I threw a pick as long as we got a tackle. We, I mean, we barely did, so I mean it wasn't really a big deal that I threw a pick. I was just trying to make sure that I gave somebody a chance to catch the ball to, to try to make it a one-score game. The book on Indiana has been uh, the running game and the short passing, but tonight you guys opened it up, like I said earlier, and getting to go downfield like that. How does that? Make you feel as far as confidence wise going forward because that's something the team's obviously going to need. Yeah, very confident. I mean, uh, you need you need all different aspects in, in offense. You know, be able to throw a deep screen game, run game, whatever it may be. And uh, when you have all those things working working together and when everything's clicking, it makes it a lot easier to score points. Not just tonight, but the past couple of weeks, you seem to develop a really good relationship with Jay Shaw and targeting him down. Touchdowns <coughs> with them. How has that kind of affected your relationship with him? And what you can do with him going forward. Yeah, I mean, he's just stepped up, and, and we've needed a guy to step up and make plays. And, uh, you know, with Wap and Luke being out, and he's and he was, you know, extremely willing and, and worked so hard, and, you know, a guy that I can easily count on and trust. So, um, you know, I can't say enough good things about him.